Hey, welcome to Zach's Tech Turf. So before I left on my military deployment, I asked you guys in this video for a bunch of Ask Me Anything questions, and today I'm gonna be answering all the personal ones. So, let's get into it. My boy Dylan Stover, make sure you guys go follow his Instagram account by the way. I'll have it right here. He has some really sick edits over there. He says, if you could visit one place in the world for tech, where would it be? And also one place not related to tech, my tech answer would be CES, which is the Consumer Electronics Show, the biggest tech show uh, in the world, I think. And that's every January. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to go to uh, this one because I'll just be getting back from the deployment uh, sometime in January, I think. So uh, next year, so CES 2019, I really wanna go to that and I think I actually will. It's in Vegas too. And then the non-tech place that I wanna go to is not somewhere specific, but I really want to go on a European cruise and I want to do one of those cruises where you just go from like country to country and then you dock there and you have like 12 hours to explore there. That way I can just knock out a bunch of countries because I've, I haven't been to Europe for more than like a day I think. Less than a day actually. So I really want to explore Europe. Samsung Smart TV says, would you ever consider owning an electric car for your daily use? Why or why not? I thought that answer would have been pretty obvious. Obviously, I would own an electric car. Um, my wife and I have been actually really considering buying a Tesla. They're super expensive right now, but she really wants the Tesla SUV, and I will review the crap out of that. So hopefully that happens. Be on the lookout for a Tesla review. Not anytime soon though, but maybe. Samsung Smart TV also asked, what car do you own? Well, here's a picture of my lifted F-150. It's a 2013 F-150. It's gray, it's got 35 inch tires on it, uh, 18 inch rims, the Rockstar 2s, and a six inch um, BDS lift kit. I'm in love with that truck. I definitely will not sell it. It's already, it's a 2013, so it's like five-ish years now, and I only have like 35,000 miles on it, so it's gonna be in the family for a long time. I love it. Alvin Rogers says, how and when did you meet your wife? My wife is actually active duty Air Force as well, and we met at our first duty station, which was in Tokyo, Japan. And uh, yeah, that's it, we met there. I'm Not Relevant asks, what is your favorite food to order? Uh, we honestly don't get takeout that much. Um, we eat somewhat healthy, I would say, for the most part, but if we ever were to get delivery, pizza or Chinese, hands down. Tyson Vlog says, who's your favorite YouTuber? I actually watch all the YouTubers that you guys probably watch if you're watching my content. MKBHD, Linus, Austin Evans, Jay's Two Cents. But if I had to pick my absolute favorite, I would narrow it down to two. Austin Evans, because I really like what he reviews and his content. It's actually a huge inspiration to my channel. And then I really like Jay's Two Cents because he actually brings a ton of information to his videos and I feel like I really get a lot out of it. Whereas some tech YouTubers these days seems like they're just playing with tech and they're reviewing it and it's just not that much value. It's actually, I get kind of upset about it but Jay's Two Cents clearly knows his stuff so he's one of my favorites. Tech Audit TV, shout out to him by the way. He says Spotify versus Apple Music versus Google Play, who wins? I've never tried Apple Music before. Well, the last time I used iTunes was back when like people used to LimeWire and stuff. So yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know about that. But I have tried Spotify and I have tried Google Play and I would pick Google Play specifically because the interface, it's a super clean and easy to navigate interface. I, I just don't like how Spotify looks, like the green and black and I don't know, Google Play, but that's not like a real answer, I guess. And finally, Connor Francis says, do you have a Patreon? I do not have a Patreon, but I have somewhat been thinking about getting one. I, I don't have enough ideas right now to bring you guys value, to pay me money. I'm not just gonna create a Patreon account for more money. Um, I wanna actually give you guys like, you know how they do it, like the different tiers, like this is what you get and stuff like that. Let me know if you guys have any ideas. I definitely have some ideas of my own, but definitely not enough to ask for your guys' money. You guys support me enough by just watching my YouTube videos. So yeah, I'm thinking about it, but let me know in the comment section if you have any ideas. What do you want from me? 
Well, that wraps up our personal Ask Me Anything questions. I wanted to thank you guys again so much for asking so many questions, well over 100 questions for me to pick from. It made my life super easy as I can just record all these before I go on my deployment and then release them throughout the deployment. So much easier, thank you very much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please drop a like down below to help support my channel. And as always, thank you for watching. And please subscribe for more Zach's Tech Turf videos.